Okay guys, so recently nakabili ako ng pantalon from Uniqlo and this is what they call the smart ankle pants. Ito, makikita mo siya. It's mo mostly plaid na colorway. Uh, plaid gray. So I figured making a bunch of content about this pants right here. I'm very excited kasi ang dami kong nakita mga sneakers in my collection na pwede or bagay na bagay sa ganong klase yung pantalon. What is up guys? This is your middle class sneakerhead Jello Pineda. Welcome back to another episode of the vlog. In today's video, we're going to talk about the top 5 sneakers that goes well with Uniqlo plaid smart ankle pants. So stay tuned. Thank you so much for checking on this video today, guys. And I do hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Kung bago ka dito and you haven't subscribed yet, consider subscribing if you haven't, if you like content just like this. And kung matagal ka narito at all, thank you so much for sticking with me. Uh, ito na ang next video. Kasi gumawa ko ng previous video before ito. And this is uh, unboxing ng mga recent kung sneaker pickups and clothing pickups. I'll link it on top of the screen para makita mo. And from there, nakita ko ang uh, advantage ng gantong klaseng pants. So, nag-check ako sa mga sneakers ko kung ano yung mga possible or ano yung mga magandang, ano, magandang mga, or babagay talaga sa gantong klaseng pantalon. Bago natin simulan, no? So, again, this one is from Uniqlo. Okay, Uniqlo. The price is 1,490 pesos. They call this the Smart Ankle Pants. Uh, open close parenthesis jersey ang sabi. I'm not sure why. Overall gray, tas makikita mo yung plaid niya or yung plaid pattern niya all over the pants. Actually, unang tingin mo dito, ano siya, uh, parang pang work, parang pang office. Although, alam ko, uh, syempre, dahil din naman nag-office, work from home pa rin. Ako, um, for me, pero for some, na nag-office na and they want to wear something like a little parang medyo appropriate for the office pero gusto pa rin nila na bagay sa kanilang mga sneakers just in case they wanna switch up from their normal leather shoes that they use for working and at the same time gusto nila mag sneakers after work so papakita ko guys kung ano yung mga bagay na sneakers dito sa pants na to ngayon pag-usapan muna natin yung fit so yung fit nito guys this one is more of that relaxed fit no uh, medyo straight siya at makikita mo dito sa baba um, hindi siya super tapered so mga parang ito yung medyo uh, matatak pa ng konti yung sneakers and that's why the sneakers on this list or on this video are somewhat appropriate na natatak pa na sa sa formahan ng mga sneakers nowadays although this is not sponsored by the way by Uniqlo baka Uniqlo yung baka naman Uniqlo pero ang ganda kasi ng fabric ng mga damit nila doon as in wala akong masabi fit wise maganda yun tayo however I do think na ano lang I do think na medyo maliit lang ako dan it, kasi, kasi ito medyo ankle pants eh. So, ang height ko is 5'6". Kung daw nakakamali, 5'6 the last time I checked. Uh, ideally, kapag ankle pants, so syempre, sumasakto lang yan sa ankle mo. Although, in my case, medyo mahaba siya ng slight. Pero kung medyo matangkad ka naman, maganda naman yung built ng katawan mo, I do think that this one would work out for you. Now, kung hindi siya okay sa'yo or medyo mahaba siya sa'yo, you can consider folding. Kasi I can see or I have seen some uh, influencers wearing these kinds of pants na nakafold. Ngayon, although ang pinaka-ultimate na forma dito ay yung talagang saktong bagsak lang nung ano niya, ng uh, length niya, and then that's it. And then a pair of sneakers that goes well with this kind of pants, and then that's pretty much it. This one is in no particular order, so lamili lang ako ng limang sneakers na pwede dito. Pero to be honest, just a disclaimer by the way, marami pang ibang sneakers ang bagay dito. It's just that ito lang ang mga meron ako for now. Alright, so first on the list... First on the list, guys, of course, we do have a pair of uh, Vans era. Okay, so, well, actually, kahit hindi mo na siya isipin, bagay talaga to sa kahit saan. Mapa maong, mapa slacks, mapa sa gantong klase mga pants, bagay talaga ang Vans era. Ba bagay din ang Vans old school, uh, bagay din yung mga may checkered. Pero in this case, since the pants itself, meron na siyang konting, uh, aside sa texture, meron na siyang pattern all over. So I do think na mas maganda ako, medyo monochromatic lang din ang mga sneakers. Or mo monochrome lang ang mga sneakers na gagamitin mo. In this case, I do think na this one is one of those sneakers na pwedeng pwede for this kind of pants. And again, these are the Vans uh, era. And what I have right here is the Comfy Kush. I've done a review of this if you haven't seen the video. Link ko sa taas para makita mo. Aside sa very comfortable sila, and aside from the fact na wala silang pinipili as in generic na sneakers talaga sila kahit saan pwede mo silang ipanterno kahit anong forma kahit medyo preppy pa yan o kahit medyo rugged pa yan Vans talaga ultimate sneaker and in my opinion one of those sneakers that every guy needs to have 
So, Vans old school, Vans era, or mga CB checkered board, o yung mga basta Vans na sneaker, uh, except yung mga high top. Pero pwede na siguro high top, depende siya. Pero I would prefer yung low tops. Napakaganda ng bagsak ng pants na to sa ganitong klase mga sneakers. And again, parang they really go hand in hand. Uh, with the with the sneaker itself, the sneaker, the pants, sobrang parang meant to be talaga sila. Alam mo ba, papasok ka ng work, naka-polar shirt ka na black, naka-plaid ka na ankle pants from Uniqlo, and then you're just wearing this, you are good to go. No brainer at all, sobrang clean look lang ang forma mo. Alright, so next on the list. Okay, so hindi ko na sila tina top 1, top 2, top 3 or what kasi ano naman, lahat naman to ay maganda in my opinion. In my humble opinion, tapos wala naman mas ano, it would depend sa nagsusuot ko ano sa palagay niya ang mas ano, ang mas okay para sa kanya. Kung saan siya mas comfortable and ano yung kaya niyang bilhin and so on. But the next sneaker is a monochrome sneaker, monochromatic sneaker, all triple white kasi bagay bagay na bagay talaga ang triple white sa ganto klase mga pants. Especially it's it's dark. And kubaga parang dahil meron na siyang sabi ko nga meron na siyang patterns hindi mo na kailangan magsuot ng something na meron na ring pattern. So this instance ito ang pangalawa. So that is a pair of Air Force Ones na triple white. So what we have right here again are the triple white Air Force One na React pero maganda pa rin naman talaga yung classic yung OG. So pero since ako ito lang ang meron ako, we'll probably have to work with this. So nasunubukan ko to with this pants, sobrang ganda as in preppy. Alam mo parang social ka na medyo medyo hindi naman kon, hindi naman kon pa ba yung tawag doon? Parang hindi na kon yung tawag doon pero napaka-fresh lang ng ano ng dating mo, napaka-fresh looking lang ng pants with this kind of pants. Ngayon, paano ba popormahan niyan? So syempre naka-pants ka, uh, suit-suit mo yung ankle pants ng unit Uniqlo na plaid, and then itong triple white, and then let's say naka-white ka lang na polo shirt. Hanggang, ay napaka-clean lang talaga. Hindi siya yung super hype beast, wala siyang hype beast effect. Um, more of pogi yung datingan. Pogi shoes, ika nga because of the triple white. Although, of course, if you are wearing a pair of triple whites when you know, you know, wala na tayong iti-deny doon. When you are wearing triple white Air Force Ones, most definitely you are, alam mo yun, syempre kahit pa paano meron kang idea about like the sneaker game. Isa sa mga naisip ko din na forma, as in like mga naka-polo shirt ka, okay, and then triple whites, or naka-clean white uh, shirt ka lang na, na, ano, na round neck, tapos itong pants, and then ito, and then you're most definitely uh, a fanny pack or a sling bag that goes along with this kind of sneaker. So, sobrang clean, sobrang mezo pro, uh, may, di naman professional, pero alam mo yung medyo yapi ka ng konti. Yapi, young professional. Okay. So, yun nga, no, nakita ko nga to, ang ganda. As in, na uh, ano talaga ako, ang dami ko tuloy naisip ng mga forma sa gantong klaseng pants. Although, you know me, I just work with black, gray, white, brown, or madala lang mag-brown, mostly talaga black. So, for me, parang black na, black na sweatshirt, Uh, and then siguro meron kang white shirt sa loob and then itong pants na to and then itong shoes man, ang ganda talaga of course, syempre ako medyo matakatakad ka ng konti at medyo bumibitin-bitin na yung pantalon mas gumaganda siya so if you want to alter kasi akong ginawa ko dyan, finold ko siya ngayon, if you do want to alter I think, hindi na magpa-alter sa Uniqlo mismo pero ako hindi ko na muna pina-alter kasi hindi ko lang kasi talaga sure yung like sa uh, like sa mga sneakers nung finit ko siya sa Uniqlo so yun, again, mas maganda medyo bitin and then bulky siya ano? bulky yung Air Force One basically that's fine kasi alam mo yung white naka white ka lang na medyo sa loob uh, white sneakers and then medyo bitin na pants na ankle pants and then you're wearing a, a plain shirt or kumbaga parang yun, alam mo yun yung mga round necks lang na very clean yung aesthetic mo overall napakaganda niyang bagayan with this kind of sneaker All right, so next up, guys. Next up, we do have a pair of, ah, this Nike Blazer Vintage 77. Okay, so explain ko lang. One reason why I bought these pants was because I saw the one I was following on IG influencer. Ah, this is the suit of pants, and this is the suit of pants, and then this is the suit of shoes. Tapos naka-black lang siya na sweatshirt. So, ito talaga. Ito talaga yung dahilan. So, nung nakita ko, nung finit ko to, itong uh, Blazer 77 mid with this pants. Ang, ay, perfect. As in, parang this shoe was, I think, made for this particular, pants in particular, no? Pwede ka mag-polo gaming, no? Kasi parang ito naman uh, is one of those sneakers from, from Nike na doesn't really require hype. Parang napaka-diverse niya yung sometimes pwede kang medyo naka-hype beast na formahan minsan medyo collegiate ka lang 
or minsan preppy ang ah, napaka diverse na sneaker na to as you know na marami na rin akong ginawang uh, ano marami na rin akong ginawang video sa kagaya nito na involved nakasama din talaga to simply because ang ganda lang talaga ng Blazer Mid 77 and at the same time na nakita kong nagmatch sila with this pants ay man bro must have na talaga tong sneaker to it's like ito yung parang ano ito yung parang Chuck Taylor ng Nike very generic lang yung mga materials hindi naman talaga super special and at the same time they don't cost a lot pero ang dami niyang forma which leads me to this fit ang ganda ng fit nito talaga with this pants pwede rin ang option nito pero rin siyang i-fold pero ako I would suggest kahit hindi na Uh, hayaan mo lang mag-sit hayaan mo lang mag yung pants dito sa ano sa sneakers mismo kasi pag nakaupo ka naman aangat na yan so makikita na yung meza so ang ganda one of the sneakers that I think are really meant for this kind of or oh, this particular pants would be a pair of blazer 77 mids Okay, so gawin natin medyo complex ng konti paano kung medyo, medyo hype yung gusto namin or medyo hindi sila yung flat or hindi sila yung kumbaga out of the usual comfort zone natin halimbawa kung sanay ka sa mga go-to sneakers lang what if medyo ano siya ng konti alright so in my rotation I do have a pair of the Fear of God Skylon Skylon 2 alright as you can see here it's mostly white and off-white sail with that patent leather swoosh actually experiment lang si wife si Daphne yung nagsabi sa akin na parang bagay siya so sinubukan ko kanina ang in fairness ha? ang ganda prepping yung preppy ito yung kasing ito yung sneaker kasi kahit white lang siya because of the usage of premium materials dito meron siya mga suede meron siya 3M meron siyang patent leather meron siyang tumbled leather meron siyang perforated leather sa tang ang ganda ng laces niya off-white sail yung midsole niya so medyo in my opinion para medyo classy siya ng konti hindi siya yung like uh, white sneaker lang so finit ko to and uh, of course yung pants And then doon ko nakita parang ang ganda nito, nakaputi ka na polo shirt or alam mo yung mga light colored na polo shirt tapos ito and then naka most definitely naka messenger bag ka lang na alam mo yun, I'm not sure I'm not really sure about bags ko anong ano pero of course yung alam mo yun, medyo classy ng konti hindi ka yung super hype beast yung dating pero when you know you know if you know fear of god you do know fear of god aside from the fact na it's white alam mo yun, yung class again classy yung dating nung sneaker and if you pair it up with a pair of pants na medyo classy din because it's plaid uh, and then number two yung fit niya yung medyo ankle uh, medyo ankle pants siya and at the same time syempre naka white ka medyo sa loob ang ganda guys sa akin ha uh, kumbaga parang isa yun sa mga nakita ko okay nakita ko na Uh, sobrang bumagay talaga sa gantong klaseng pantalon. So, pero overall, again, yung aesthetic nitong Fear of God Skylon, irregardless kung Fear of God siya or hindi, ang ganda ng silhouette, mostly yung silhouette for this, nagkataon lang kasi na yung materials ng sneaker na to, with, again, with those materials that I've mentioned earlier, goes really well with this kinds of uh, pants. And now, last but not the least, guys, eto, 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 eto talaga, Um, nakita ko sobrang sobrang bagay nito pinaka ano sa akin would be a pair of Jordan 1 so in my case pin I paired this one up with a pair of Kodak JP in the Midnight uh, Metallic Navy and man ang ganda <laughs> ang ganda ng forma niya guys as in alam yung parang ano talagang um, although it's a Jordan 1 nandun na tayo sa hype side nandun na tayo sa hype side of things then number 2 clean aesthetic because of uh, syempre Uh, more of uh, that white color parang Chicago color blocking white tongue white toe box white panels and so on white midsole so kumbaga parang clean lang siya kapag natakpan na ng pantalon yung upper part ng Jordan 1 as ang ganda ng itsura niya talaga sa, sa opinion ko lang ha? sa opinion ko lang feeling ko talaga napaka perfect niya with this kind of ano ngayon pwede naman ibang kulay pwede naman yung mga court purple pwede naman yung game basta yung clean looking na Jordan 1. So, I do think talaga match made in heaven siya. Especially, navy yung color. Navy and white. Tapos, gray yung up. O, oh, gray yung pants. Pwede kang mag-black na uppers or pwede kang, or I mean top. Pwede ka rin mag-white na top. Or pwede mong sabayan. Pwede mong ternuhan. Nasa iyo yun. Pero, in my opinion, napaka ano, napaka, parang sobrang ganda ng pagkakamatch ng uh, ganto, ng mga Jordan 1s with this one. Teka, question. Papaano naman kung hindi puti yung Jordan 1 ko? Okay lang kaya siya? So, ito nga sinubukan ko siya with a pair of, ano, a uh, pair of gym reds. Alright, so a pair of gym reds, although color blocking, somewhat same, white toe box, white paneling, pero black yung tongue niya. And then, of course, dahil black yung the rest of the sneaker, uh, sinubukan ko pa rin siya. 
And of course, kahit pa in my opinion, pwede bagay pa rin naman siya. You can't discount the fact na they really go, or Jordan once go, goes along with a lot of uh, pants nowadays. Pwede kang naka-skinny, pwede kang, or naka-relax fit, pwede kang naka-straight cut, pwede kang naka um, chinos. So, sobrang bagay pa rin talaga ng Jordan once sa gantong klaseng pants. So, again, when I tried it on earlier, Ang ganda pa rin ng fit niya. In my opinion lang, in my humble opinion. Ngayon, paano mo siya popormahan? Siguro, dito na yung mga medyo sweat. Kasi, um, hindi, hindi na siya yung super clean looking unlike itong nauna. Hindi na siya yung parang fresh na looking. Ito dahil medyo, ano na siya, medyo black and white and red. So, I think you can uh, switch it up. You can actually wear a couple of band shirts. So, I've seen some, ang ginagawa nila, naka band shirt. Okay, tapos itong pants and then naka-fold lang talagang bitin na bitin yung pants and then shoes. Uh, depende ko anong shoes, kung naka-vans ka or something. And I would think that they would really go along with a pair of Jordan 1. So, band shirts, band tees, I will try one time. Uh, comment down below if you do want an overall fit of the day look or lookbook. I will do that. I'll start doing that. Wala lang akong talagang enough space for me to do that. But if you guys want, comment down below. Gagawin ko para sa inyo kung paano natin popormahan ng buong-buo ang ganong klaseng pantalon. Alright, so there you guys have it. Those are my top 5 or my 5 sneakers that goes along with Uniqlo Smart Ankle Pads. Okay, so again, this is not a sponsored video by Uniqlo, pero naganda nang talaga ako sa tela ng or sa pants nila. And again, these guys are selling for 1,490 pesos. I'll try to link it on the description if I find it on their website. But then again, I do hope na gusto min video na to. And if you did, please go ahead and smash that like button dito sa baba para matulong yung algorithm. And I would think it would really help a lot. If you do, it helps the channel grow. And at the same time, kung bago ka dito, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please make sure that you do so if you like content just like this. And at the same time, kung matagal ka na dito tol, you know what it is. I appreciate you so much, man. So yun na muna for the meantime. Maraming maraming salamat for checking on this video today, guys. And I will see you on the next one. Peace, guys.